Hey everyone, so a bit of a different video here um, today. Uh, this is Tanner and I have my good friend Mason with me. What's up guys? And this is not a man-to-man -man coverage podcast episode. We're doing a Marvel episode, I guess the Marvel to Marvel podcast. But <laughs> <laughs> in all seriousness, uh, we're uh, both big MCU fans. Um, I, I was going to do a tier list, but I don't know. I feel like all you need to know is that they're all good except Thor 2. Um, <laughs> so we're going to be doing an MCU quiz today. How, how are you feeling about this, Mason? Um, I'm a little nervous. I might be a little rusty, but I think we'll do good. Same. Uh, hopefully it goes better than me and my stats class. So I want to oh, no. begin <laughs> with Iron Man. I think there's a question per movie. So can we get a perfect score? What song plays at the beginning of the movie in Iron Man? Um, let's see. Back in Back in Black just seems like a movie that, uh, or a song that'd be in Marvel because it's ACDC. Overrated, but still good. So I, I agree. Um, Iron Man, I think, plays at the end. Yeah. It might be Ordinary World or Stairway to Heaven. Uh, probably it's probably ordinary world or stairway to heaven yeah it's back in black would be a little weird to just have blasting in the beginning <laughs> of a movie so yeah um i i feel like which one are you leaning towards mason probably ordinary I think it's world ordinary. let's see nope oh, it's back in black. <laughs> <laughs> oh that's the um, scene oh my i forgot that was the scene that started all right yeah what do you think of iron man one i think it's a bit overrated but still enjoyable um a little shaky i think it was the first one but it was still a pretty good movie because I'm, I'm a big iron man guy all right the incredible hulk none of us have seen this film in fact mason didn't know it existed till like 30 <laughs> Um, what does Tony tell? Yeah, so I Tony Stark appears at the end credit of the scene, he makes a cameo. So, what does Tony tell that dude at the end of the film? Probably they're putting a team together. I mean, I mean, I don't know. The O's and money is a little weird. Study, the study the Hulk the actually Hulk makes thing. sense too. Actually, maybe the shield. I forgot he like they're at a bar and like talking like hey maybe the team because Hulk joins the Avengers. That's what I was thinking too. Correct. Hey, we, we didn't even see it. We got it better than <laughs> Iron Man. <laughs> Iron Man two is a big goof for me. I mean, so you like this movie, right? Iron Man two. Oh, I know this one. I I believe it is. Uh, isn't it Romanov or is that her real name? That's her real name. Oh God. <laughs> I feel like it's Rabe. I don't know. That sounds like something. Hey, Nate these are all awesome. Natalie Rushman. That doesn't sound right. I mean, Nicole Rohan. Yeah, I'm probably leaning towards a Nicole Rohan on that one. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I like how like that's not it. That ends up being it. Like, how, makes... like how the only one we got right is the movie I haven't seen. It's all right. It's all right. <laughs> yeah. Um. Okay, Thor. What does Thor want? Another one. He's in the diner. It's it's. I think a cup of coffee, because he like throws down the cup. You know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Please. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, look at Thor right there. Oh my gosh, <laughs> dude, what uh, the heck? Thor one I find really boring. It's probably one of my least favorite MCU films. And Thor two. Oh no, Thor two is about to come up, isn't it? Oh, okay. Mm. Where does Peggy tell yep. Steve she wants to meet him for a dance, but before he plunges into ice? I have no idea. I remember the scene, kind of. Um, maybe the cotton club? I'm guessing it's a club. Um, the stork I, club? I, <laughs> just all the birds hang out there. There's just... <laughs> <laughs> Dude, all that might be the one. Because every time we say one that's like wrong, we, it's usually right. All right. <laughs> <laughs> no way no way um i really like captain america one i i love it oh, i like the, i like the old like 1940s vibes to the whole movie that was really good World yeah War 
This is trivia in a slight review. The Avengers love it. Natasha remarks to Clint that the Bound New York is a lot like what? Pa- Panama, bro. Wait, what? That was Panama. The Budap- oh, it's Budapest. It's Budapest. Um, there we yes. go. I know that uh, one. Man, I love the Avengers. Um, who's your, What's your favorite action scene, Mason, in the first oh, Avengers? Dude, the best one is where they're all like, uh, they all have their backs to each other. Mm-hmm. And it's like the panoramic of all of them together in the final uh, fight. That was so cool. Yeah. I also like the one like Thor and Iron Man fight. It's very brief, but it's pretty neat. I love how in Endgame they did that shot you talked about again. Like they showed it again. Because mm-hmm. I never saw Avengers 1 in theater. Iron Man 3, really underrated movie. What is the name of the little boy? Oh, no. I, I think it's. I thought, I thought it was Harley. It's Henry Trust. It's Harley. It's like, how's it Henry? Oh, no. It's Henry Trust. <laughs> it's Big Harley. Tr- you know what makes I'll go Henry, but I know it's Harley. It is. <laughs> <laughs> uh, um, I think one phase two now, or is Iron Man 3 phase two? Oh, Iron Man 3 is really underrated. Oh, no. It's Harley. Dude, it really, I thought, who's he- dude Henry, bro? I thought <laughs> Damn, that's crazy. Oh, no. We have the worst MCU movie coming up. Oh, no. <laughs> well, who, who, who's Volstag? You don't ask me. <laughs> Where do you sit? Okay. Um, it's on Vorm. Okay. It's on Vorm. The rea- wait. Yeah. Oh. Oh, the collector. Oh, so I didn't bad. even read through all the answers. <laughs> this is hard. Winter Soldier, one of the best MC movies. What does the Winter Soldier say after Steve recognizes him? I think it's he's gone. I remember yeah. it being really emotional. Probably. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. All of these are correct. We're big MCU I mean... fans, yeah, I swear. <laughs> what were the three items Rocket claims? I know a prosthetic leg was involved, so let's see if it's part of... The, yep, okay, there's two different prosthetic leg ones. Gosh darn it. I think it was a security man and a battery. Yeah, I'd go that. Yes, yeah, we got yeah, one yeah. right. I knew it was a prosthetic leg. It's all I knew. I love Guardians 1. Probably my favorite Marvel movie, so... Oh my gosh, the the movie and the soundtrack was amazing. And it's like a surprise movie, too. Like, everyone was like, what is this? But it came together really well. Oh, no. Not Age of Ultron. Language. Um, <laughs> what does Tony utter that makes... I feel like it's shit or idiot. Was it uh, asshole? I would, or I'm crap? Going, going, I'm going shoot. Same. There yeah. we go. Age of Ultron, I don't like it. I find it boring. Mason, what do you think of it? Um, it's not that amazing, but I like how they're tying it into WandaVision, kind of. That's redeeming about it, um, yeah. but I still don't like it. The movie's just boring, so... Mm-hmm. It's, a little, it's a little weird compared to the other Avengers movies. It, re- it really is a weird movie. Like, I don't know, I just don't like it. Ant-Man, love this movie. What animal does Darren Cross unsuccessfully drink? A shrink? (laughs) (laughs) He's drinking animals. Um, I remember he like, he like shrunk, I think. I want you shrunk a goat successfully. Would it be a sheep? Duck? Mm. This is the villain guy. He was pretty forgettable. Um... What animal does Darren Cross unsuccessfully shrink? It's probably like a random one, like a duck. We should just go. Du- I don't feel like it's the duck. I mean, what should neither. be the duck? I don't think it's duck either. That makes me think it is the duck. <laughs> I feel like it might be sheep. I'm gonna leave this one in your hands. <laughs> I don't know. Yes, hey, it's nice. It's sheep. What do you think of Ant Man? I really like it. Paul Rudd's great in the movie. I like I like it a lot. Yeah, Paul Rudd is like the perfect character for him, man. Like his comedy is just really good with the movie too. Paul Rudd is just really good in everything. He should be in a Star Wars movie. Okay, Civil <laughs> War. Who is on Iron Man's team? Let's see. 
Um, I think it's Hawkeye. Let's see. Because Black Panther was rest in peace, Chadwick Boseman. Vision was Black Widow betrays him, but she starts off on Iron Man's team. I think it's Hawkeye. Because it was War Machine, Iron Man, Black Panther, Vision, Black Widow, and Spider Man. I think you're right because Hawkeye. I'm pretty sure Hawkeye chased down. Tony. Him and Falco chased Falcon chased down uh, Spider Man. I think. Yeah, it was Cap. Was that Bucky? Oh, that was Bucky. No, I think Cap, Falcon, and Bucky both. Tra- no, yeah, Falcon. Oh my, Falcon and Winter Soldier. Bucky both chased down Spider Man. So. It's- or was Cap- it a trick question of Black Widow is the answer because she switched? Well, I remember early on, remember like Tony and Hawkeye are joking about like Tony's like how's retirement and Hawkeye was like, oh, it's good. And he like shoots behind Iron Man. Oh, yeah. Star, yeah which go, I go, think let's go with Hawkeye. Hawkeye. Okay, hey. that was a really complicated way of saying it's Hawkeye. <laughs> what was your favorite uh, fight scene in the airport battle? Oh, the airport battle? My favorite scene was when Spider-Man was, like, trolling uh, Falcon and Bucky. <laughs> that was hilarious. Oh, yeah. yeah. I, that, that's probably my favorite iteration of Spider-Man, the MCU. Um, Doctor Strange, okay movie. What type of doctor? He's a... Oh, he's... He I'm a, like, he's a surgeon. Is he a neurosurgeon? Yeah. It's probably something weird. Yeah. <laughs> probably um, something I, weird. <laughs> I like Doctor Strange. It's okay. Um, it's solid. Guardians of the Galaxy 2. I'm Mary Poppins, y'all. Hey. Don't like Guardians of the Galaxy 2 as much, but Yondu and that whole... His death was pretty great in it. His death was awesome. What? <laughs> 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 I get what you mean, though. Um, Spider-Man Homecoming, where, who does Stan Lee appear as? Rest in peace. I feel like it's a neighbor. No. Shows, a neighbor, a guy who works at a hot dog cart. <laughs> it's not, I remember, because, like, Spider-Man was doing, like, stopping neighborhood crime, and he was, like, in an apartment complex. I go that one, then. I, yeah. Hey. Uh, oh, Stanley I remember Cameron. that scene, yeah. Mm-hmm. I love Spider-Man Homecoming. It's one of my favorite MCU movies, and I know, I know you really like it, Mason. Yeah, it's a great movie. Here's, here's probably one of my favorite MCU movies, not including Avengers. For Ragnarok, yeah, I love it. I love the tonal shift. Really funny. I like what they did with Hulk, too. Um, I don't know her number at all. You might know it, Mason. Her scrapper number, Valkyrie. Really nice character. Just go 2-3-2. Two, two. just sounds like a... Yep, all right, sick. 1-4-2. <laughs> <laughs> Black Panther. What do, you... what do they steal from the thing? Um, I think it was a mask. Because I remember he was like holding up the mask. So I think it's uh hey. boom. Killmonger, one of the best MC villains. Black Panther, really good movie. Michael in B. Fact, Jordan was great in that movie too. He was. What do you think about the theory that you know, unfortunately, that Chadwick Boseman passed away. That they might make, like, the theory is that they'll bring back Killmonger to life and make him the hero. I think that'd be uh, pretty cool, just like honor Chadwick Boseman in a way. I think that'd be kind of cool to see. I'm not the biggest fan of it, but it could work. Like you said, Michael B. Jordan's fantastic. Um, Infinity War, one of my favorite MC movies. Um, Mason, you really like it as well. Um, yep. What elective class did Thor? Take on Asgard? What? What elective class? <laughs> Bro, this ain't college. Okay, well, it's not. I don't think it's learning to speak to Groot. Well. Isn't it? <sighs> hammer I remember in that film, he meets the Guardians, and it's like Rocket, Groot, and Thor going on an adventure. What did he learn in a class? What? I don't think it's rabbits. I mean, I know he calls like Rocket, Raccoon, a rabbit, but I don't think it's that. Does he end up flying a spaceship at all? I think Rocket flies it. I remember he like talks so good. He understands him. He's like, how did you know that? He's like elective. Either that or hammer making. But I feel like we Hammer making so obvious. I feel like it's I feel like it's a group. Yeah. I feel like hammer making is so obvious. It's group. Yay. Nice. I don't, know what, I don't remember that at all, but 
This is when they first first meet. I love how Thor's with the Guardians in that movie. Ant-Man the Wasp. Scott hid an old Ant-Man suit underneath a trophy. What did the trophy say? World's greatest grandma? Greatest... (laughs) It's I think it's uh, I think it's grandma actually. Yeah. You're right. Okay. <laughs> I, think I, I think I remember that. World's greatest I, grandma. I feel like this movie is really underrated. Like no one really talks about it enough. I think it's super underrated. I like the wasp character. Uh I like yeah. the I, I like the whole thing. I like the villain. I liked how um The villain's really good, very unique. Yeah. Overall good movie. Yeah, I thought it was funny. Good action. Um, it ties into, Apple, uh, what's it called? Uh, Endgame. Game. It does. It does. Captain Marvel, what is Carol's nickname for Monica? Um, um. <laughs> what am I like Lieutenant Trouble? Because like, Captain Marvel has like that sarcastic humor like a lot of MC characters have. So, Is this the same Monica from WandaVision or no? It is. Oh, I did not know that. Yeah, that's pretty cool. They have her growing up. That is cool, yeah. I feel like it could be... Com- I don't know. I, I feel like it's either Lieutenant Trouble or Commander Monica, but that sounds like the obvious answer. Maybe yeah. Lieutenant Trouble. Yeah, go, go Lieutenant right there. Hey. One yeah. thing I like about WandaVision is like how they have characters from different movies. Like You have Monica from Captain Marvel. You have Jimmy, um, Jimmy from <laughs> Ant-Man the Wasp, which we just talked about. Um, they have um, Kat Dunning's character, Dr. Lewis, from the Thor movie. So I like the, how they kind of come together. Mason, what do you think of Captain Marvel? Because most people don't like it. I enjoy it. I don't love it, but it's like a solid movie. I thought it was a cool movie because it like I didn't know anything about Captain Marvel, and they left it on a big cliffhanger um for infinity war so i think it was a cool movie to see after infinity war because of the ending credit scene where like uh what's it called i'm missing it blanking on his name yo but, nick fury drops yeah, nick, the signal. yeah i thought that was really cool yeah i like the movie i like brie Larson in the role i think she did a good job um good action i like the whole scroll twist Avengers Endgame, love this movie. What is Natasha's final line before she sacrifices herself on Voromir? Tell everyone I... Clint? I... Oh, no. <laughs> What's so funny? She says, <laughs> it'd, be, it'd be bad if she says, tell everyone I, and then she just falls. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. I feel like it's let me go because they're, like, struggling off the cliff. It's, def- it's, it's either it's okay or let me go, for sure. Well, it should be tell everyone I. <laughs> if it is, bro, I'm going to laugh. <laughs> Let's go let me go. Oh, it's okay. Okay. Uh, at least it wasn't tell everyone I. <laughs> <laughs> um, I love Endgame. Like the whole I love you 3000 is great. Iron Man snapping, bringing that whole thing together is awesome. Cap wielding Mjolnir is awesome. But I, I don't like Black Widow's death. It felt kind of rushed. Oh yeah, that that was like really shocking too. Like I was shocked mm-hmm. that she actually died because usually you don't see that happen. Well, um, I guess a lot. I, I'm sorry, no, no, I got it spoiled for me because I was on oh, the, no. I was on the Green Bay Packers Instagram, <laughs> and they're posting some of the, like the NFL draft that year, and someone in the comments is like Black Widow and Iron Man die. I'm like, bruh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, okay. <laughs> but yeah, <That's> sick. <laughs> Spider-Man Far From Home. Um, like this movie, Mysterio, Jake Gyllenhaal is the best part, in my opinion. Um, what necklace does Peter buy for MJ? It's a black dahlia. And you're all right. And 16? Oh, wow. I thought we got a lot more wrong. That is that correct? Well, how's that 49%? No, we are we're better than 49% of quiz takers. That's oh, okay. That's pretty good. I'm um, looking back on the ones we missed. Um, <laughs> the first couple were great. Um, that makes sense now that I see the scene. Mm-hmm. Um, Hulk one. I like how we got that right now. We didn't see it. That one makes sense. Thor. Yeah. Oh, no, not yeah. the Henry one. No, the Henry <laughs> one. 
<laughs> I, I, I get, I, I can see how you get that confused. They're very similar names, and he didn't really stand out in the movie. I liked his character, it's just not the most memorable. Wasn't he at the Iron Man's funeral? He was. That was pretty. That cool. was a cool detail. Um, this one, I see that. Um, I we didn't re- I didn't read all the answers, but <laughs> <laughs> collecting makes sense. Um, I I thought he said who is Bucky, but oh no, I thought they said he's gone because that makes sense. I like, got uh, emotional stuff, and I think we got the rest of them correct. Yes. Sheep, Hawkeye. All right, everyone, that'll do it for this video. Uh, Mason, thanks for joining me, man. Yeah, thanks for having um, me. This is a lot of fun. No problem. Um, I'm glad we did better at the end there because that would have been really bad. If we... <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. um, let us know if you want to see more. Um, check out the Man to Man Coverage podcast where Mason and I do NFL stuff. We might do an NFL trivia video podcast one time i think that would be really cool but hope you enjoyed this fun video and until then take care